What's going on guys, Cloudbuster 100 here. We're gonna play another walkthrough of Persona 3 Reload. Persona! I hope you've been enjoying my Persona walkthrough. Sorry for the lack of updates lately. I've been so focused on Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. I kind of neglected this, so we're gonna try to make some videos here and there. I'm trying to split both that one and this one, so at least we can both get the stories walk through. If you've been enjoying these walkthroughs so far of Persona 3 Reload, hit that like button for this video. And if you are new to this channel and want to see more of these videos that are very interested in watching my channel, hit that subscribe and smash that notification button. Thanks for watching. Enjoy the video. Let's get started. So we are at the school and it is June 5th. So we are a couple, a few days away from doing of doing the next full moon operation. And so far this game has been doing really well. They've really did a well bang up job of this game so far and I'm really happy to get to play it. Also for those who have not seen it yet, I will say that for an announcement of Persona 3 Reload, they just announced an expansion pass for Persona 3 Reload, which is the Aegis story of, you get, it takes place after Persona 3 Reload, the story. For So, I'm not going to say anything because of spoilers, but you get to play as her, and then just learn more about the concept of the story of Persona 3 Reload. Hmm. Hold on. Do I have a persona over that has the hippotron? Mmm. Damn. I don't have the persona arcana, so we're gonna quickly run to Paulinina Mall to get one. That must be then one of the new Arcanas. But before we do anything else, do we need... I'm going to temporarily release Archangel. We're going to go inside real quick. This is why you need more Personas, so that way you can have more available to do this. So we're going to the summon this is your progress so far. of the Capodium. There we go. So you'll be summoning this one? Very well, it's yours. It does suck you gotta spend it does suck you gotta spend a little bit of that money, but it helps increases your chances of your bonds. Okay, now that we got that taken care of. Gonna move down here. I heard the old couple is one like one of the ones you want to get done the most, so that's why I'm kind of. Oh my god! Seriously. Oh well. Guess we'll just have to just do what we got. Sometimes you can't get them all. Well, that was a little down, but oh well, nothing I could do there. Okay, as we agreed on Monday, we'll now hold a meeting to discuss what we've learned. Wow, you're really into this. Of course I am. I got lots of good info, and it turns out there was no angry ghost involved. Oh, so that's what's important, huh? First off, let's talk about how this rumor got started. The girl was found on the school grounds, so it does match the ghost story on that point. But why did the rumor spread so fast if this was the first time anything happened? Correct. But yeah, I was surprised when I found out. After that first incident, the exact same thing happened to two other students. All three victims had to be hospitalized. No wonder people thought it was a ghost. Okay, moving on. 
The victims were all in different classes, and at first glance, they don't seem to be connected. But they did have one thing in common. Anyone know what it was? What is this? A quiz show? <laughs> Do you know? What did all three victims have in common? Oh, whoops. Not just once or twice either. They all got in with a bad crowd and were always outlawed. Considering they all ended up the same way, it can't just be a coincidence. So, to find out what happened, we're going to do some field research. Oh, joy. What? Field research? Yep. There's one place where all three victims were regulars. Whoa, hang on. You're not talking about that spot behind Port Island Station, are you? Oh, you know about it? Dude, you can't go there. I've heard all kinds of nasty rumors about that place. Oh, really? Well, then all the more reason we should go together. You're coming with, right? Now we're talking. Oh, man. I don't know about this. That place is seriously bad news. Do we really have to go there? Up until now, all we've done is follow orders. Isn't it about time we start thinking for ourselves? She's not wrong. I mean, but... Man, I not see it like that. I guess I don't have a choice, do I? Then it's settled. We'll go tomorrow night, so plan accordingly. Jeez. <laughs> She just did. She just kept denying that it was a ghost story and stuff. The most thing we can do for now is until we can get to that part is we'll just keep uh, doing our social stats. Gonna go to Paul Lunia Mall real quick here. I don't know if I sold any of my stuff from the last tower. stuff sold that's a, doesn't sell a lot that's what sucks sometimes even though I was like hunting all those uh, shadows and that that's what... just gonna make some time here not surprised there Our academics up a little bit. It's weird because I'm always used to Persona 5 having a lot of questionnaire stuff happening and all that stuff. What's this? Oh, okay, yeah, the mandatory plan tonight thing. After school? Wow, that was fast. So we can't do anything with the track team or any of the others, so what we're going to do is work on... I think the next one we should do is... It's probably Chihiro. Yeah. Since she's a rare one that we don't get to do very much. Not at all. Some people are just not good at certain things. I never even wanted this job. Someone else entered me into the running. Didn't think I would actually get elected, though. Oh, but I don't regret joining the student council or anything. If I hadn't joined, then I wouldn't have met such kind people like you or the president. Shut up. You're distracting us. Oh, I I I'm sorry. What a bitch. Flirt with each other, go do it outside. I'm so tired of this. 
can't even pick up my pencil anymore. But if you give me a kiss, maybe I can study for another 30 minutes. Oh, brother. What are you going on about now? Come on, you've got to take this seriously. Don't you want us to go to the same college? Just give me a kiss. Please. Oh, brother. I would say they have no shame. That's right. I agree. This is supposed to be a place of learning, and they're still just kids. So I say this as a member of the student council. That kind of inappropriate behavior should not be tolerated at school. We should notify the student council president right away and discuss this at our next meeting. She's a sweet girl. She's definitely, I can see why she's uh, one of the choices you can get as a girlfriend. you think it is how are you scared of ghosts but totally fine with this because stuff you can't see is way creepier she's not wrong actually i'm more worried about the things i can't see like bats and knives <sighs> big deal so it's a little dangerous come on let's strike while the iron's hot Strike. <laughs> yep. Strike card. You're actually excited about this? <laughs> <laughs> oh, these guys are hilarious. Let's go, team. to be here. Hey, are you nuts? Read the room, won't you? I can read just fine. Come on. Don't be intimidated by these punks. <laughs> Damn. You say? Your car is... She just called us punks. Come she... on. Let's post some pictures that'll make her daddy cry. Hope you've been practicing your sexy poses. <laughs> Good. These guys are scum. I agree. Oh, so now we're scum, huh? Man, I feel sorry for you, goatee. This bitch is a real pain in the ass, isn't she? 
That's enough. They didn't know what they were getting into. I'll make sure they leave. You good with that? Who do you think you are, dumbass? You guys about to knock your ass out. You want some too? Woohoo! Damn! Son of a bitch! You just crossed the line. You think you're going home alive now? Should we find out? Uh no? Maybe not. <laughs> oh man, you loser. Bastard. Your name's Aragaki, right? Yeah. Now I remember. Shinjiro Aragaki. You're from Gecko High too, aren't you? Damn it, you're gonna regret this! Oh man, Senpai! That was awesome! I remember you. You guys were in Aki's room at the hospital. You idiots. Can't argue with that. Home. You don't belong here. Wait. Sorry, but there's something we need to know before we leave. Did Aki tell you to come here? <laughs> well, what do you want to know? Is this about that ghost story? Yes, that's right. How'd you know? The rumor's been going around. Those girls who wound up in the hospital were here talking shit every night. They'd brag about all the stuff they did to some girl named Yamagishi. Yamagishi? You mean Fuka Yamagishi from 2E? They were picking on her? That's why people are saying it's Yamagishi's ghost that did it. Yamagishi-san's ghost? Wait, what do you mean by that? You guys don't know? This Yamagishi girl might be dead. I heard she hasn't been home in over a week. Wait, what? I thought she was just out recovering. So, you mean she's still missing? So much for that ghost story. Mr. Okoda is the homeroom teacher for 2E, right? Does he know about this? I get it, Aki. Still trying to make up for the past. Hmm. It's you who can let go. Huh? Nothing. Anyways, it's all I know. We done here? Yeah, totally. Thanks a lot. Come on. Show some appreciation. Just don't come around here again. Thank you for helping us and for sharing what you know. That was really nice of you. Huh? Oh, uh, sorry. Just don't come here again. Can't exactly blame him. Okay, so not only did we just met with Shinjiro again, now we know that Fuka is missing. My theory is she's probably in the tower, Tartarus, somehow. Though, she should have been out of there, though, the moment it goes to past the midnight hour. But then again, I don't know if you get stuck in there or not, but probably that is the case. Go here real quick. Do some more stuff here. But I won't say anything, but damn. Let's keep working on our knowledge. Honestly, that's the most crucial thing to get done. Because it, the more smarter we are, the better for us to do stuff on the missions. Or for the exams and that. Because the more do we do better in the exams, we can get better stuff, uh, rewards and stuff. I don't know if this will get us a rank up or not. 
Nah, I didn't yet. So, we're still not there yet. But it's a work in progress. We are now on Sunday, so we are now... have no school. We're obviously gonna hang out with Maya, though, because... We're not gonna do those because they don't really give you a uh, rank up. Let's see what we can get from the TV. It's amazing, commodities. amazing commodities, huh? I'm going to do it. Good, good. Perfume. Not bad, kid. Why not? Might as well use it for something. Thanks, kid. Bye bye. And now we're gonna hang out with Maya. Good response for this one. I could say what bass are honestly, because I feel like that sounds a little more. Man, she's really getting frustrated with this. Let's see what rank we're on now. We are rank six. She's actually the highest one I have right now, too. Okay, so tomorrow we're going to be taking care of some things. This must be their summer outfits. That's a heck of a look you curry has. That's actually a kind of an interesting outfit Mitsuru has. Gonna work on our confidence now. Can't believe it costs like a thousand yen just to eat from there. Oh crap, I forgot. Oh, hopefully we can go to the velvet room. I need to replace one persona. Oh, here you senpai. Why are you here? Same reason you are. Mr. Akoda, I'm here to ask you about a student named Fuka Yamagishi. No! Please, I, I never thought it'd turn out this way. Fuka. Hey, I remember you. 
What did you do to Yamagishi? Hold on, Kiri Jokun. This isn't an interrogation. Stop scaring her. Ryama, you don't have to say anything if you don't want to. You wouldn't want to give her the wrong idea. Uka, she she always looked so frazzled whenever I gave her a hard time. That's when I realized she may be a model student, but deep down she's just like us. And because of that, I knew exactly which buttons to push. We were just messing with her earlier that day, too. It was May 29th. We took Fuka to the gym and locked the door from the outside. What? You trapped her inside? Uh, I hate bullying more than anything. That pisses me off. I'm gonna say this. That's not funny. That night, Maki got worried Fuka might commit suicide, so... She went back to the school by herself, but she never came back. And the next morning, she was found lying outside the front gate. I went to the gym to let Puka out, but the door was still locked. So I opened it and went inside, but she wasn't there. We all freaked out. Starting that night, we went out looking for her. But every night, another one of us wouldn't come back. And then they all ended up like Maki. I see. Mr. Okoda, all this time you've been reporting Yamagishi is absent due to illness. But the truth of the matter is that she was missing. You had to have known this. Explain yourself. I was thinking of the students, of course. You children may not understand, but we have to consider the future of everyone affected. So you chose not to report a missing child for the good of the class, and not because you didn't want the police involved. It... it was in her best interest. I wouldn't want her records to be stained by something like this. Her parents agreed. That's bullshit. It's because her parents are probably rich or something, or some kind of politician stuff. So to protect your career, you ignored your responsibility as a teacher. He's scum. Despicable. You're screwed, dude. Your job is you're definitely fired. That's enough. You can go now. We'll handle the rest. Wait, what? Don't worry. This won't be the last you'll hear of this. <laughs> you're screwed, dude. About your friends. Did you notice anything unusual about them before they went missing? Anything at all? A voice. A creepy voice. They all mentioned it right before they went missing. They said they could hear it, calling their name. Oh, man. Senpai, could it be? It's them. No doubt about it. Up Shit. until now, we've never been able to predict who exactly would become aware during the dark hour. This voice must be the key. In other words, it doesn't just happen randomly. They actually get drawn in. I realize now, after seeing all of this, they're clearly targeting humans. Shadows are most definitely the enemy of mankind. No shit. Stay at our dorm tonight. That should be the safest place. If you hear the voice, tell us immediately. And don't leave your room no matter what happens. If you can manage that, you should be fine. Don't worry. Yamagishi should be alright as well. Luka. <laughs> Yori and Takeba too. We'll meet after school in the student council room to discuss tonight's operation. Tonight? Yes. We are going to rescue Fuka Yamagishi. If my guess is right, she's still inside the school. Understood. Good. You're all here. Tonight, we're infiltrating the campus. Our objective is to rescue Fuka Yamagishi. Uh, I don't get it. Are you saying Yamagishi is inside the school somewhere? And why are we doing this at night? At midnight, this place turns into... Exactly. That's how Yamagishi wandered into Tartarus. Wait! You mean Yamagishi-san's been over there ever since she got locked in the gym? 
That's right. But that was ten days ago. No matter how you look at it, she's gotta be. Don't lose hope just yet. Tartarus only appears during the dark hour. So where does it go for the rest of the day? That's a good point. This is just a theory. But I think time flows differently in Tartarus. So even though it's been ten days for us, it could have only been ten hours for her. There's a chance she's still alive. He might not be wrong on that. Wow, you think so? But wait. Isn't the dark hour pretty brutal though? Even for us, how could she last ten days worth in there? That is true. And even if she is still alive, we might not be able to get to her. Are you just gonna abandon her then? I have an idea. Let's try to enter Tartarus the same way Yamagishi did. We'll go to the gym and wait for midnight. That'll be the quickest way. Is that really gonna work? In all honesty, I can't say I fully agree with this. If something goes wrong, you could all end up lost in Tartarus too. But... I'm not just gonna stand here and do nothing. If there's a chance we can save her, I'd never forgive myself. If you guys aren't with me, then I'm going in on my own. Senpai? All right, we know it's risky, but we also can't just leave her there. Right, and we won't know until we try. Guess we're sneaking into the school then. <laughs> In that case, I've got just the thing. You do? This should be interesting. <laughs> oh, jeez. All right. I'll let you handle this. There's no time to waste. Let's go. An actual explosive? Uh, no. Uh, all I did was unlock a door. Got in, no problem. Man, I'm a genius. Oh god, now he's gonna have a Is big head. Really something to brag about here? I agree with you, Kari, on that one. So you unlocked it earlier. Très bien. We, oui, good job. We should find somewhere to get ourselves ready. Your classroom should work, right? Uh, what? Trey Ben? Is that French or something? Why are they talking in different languages anyway? Oh god. Can we turn on the lights? Aw, you scared? No, I'm not. Stupé. Hey, <laughs> called for. Stupé. Quiet. We need to get started. It's better for us if the lights are off. They cut the power at night anyway. I don't really like sneaking around. First, we have to find the key to the gym. It should be in either the faculty office or the janitor's room. You three check the faculty office. Akihiko and I will take the janitor's room. After that, we'll meet in the main hallway on the first floor. Understood? All right. So, we're searching the faculty office, huh? Hey, maybe we'll find some test questions. <laughs> <laughs> You're scum. Maybe I should go to the faculty office too. It sounds interesting. You're not planning to do something unethical under my supervision, are you? I mm. suppose you'll need to be executed. Ooh. Hey, come on! Obviously, I was joking. <laughs> no, you weren't. <laughs> you were so... All I meant by interesting was that there's a higher chance of finding the key there. Enough with the excuses. Let's head to the janitor's room. <laughs> Yori, you're coming with us. Oh, snap! All right, let's get this over with. She so called on you guys' asses. 
We're actually in the school, that's interesting. Even at night, that's very interesting, to say the least. I think we'll have to go downstairs here. Oh shit. Do you hear something? What? There's someone else here? We gotta hide. Crap. <sighs> it was just a security guard. Oh jeez. My phone. <laughs> I can't blame her on that one. I she got scared there. And of course it's just spam. I mean that would freak most people out, right? Come on, the thing just rang out of nowhere. I wanna say that was cute. What? That's not funny, you know. <laughs> I just wanted to do that just be funny. Okay. I'm pretty sure once we do this, we gotta. We won't be able to save or anything. Hmm. Let's enter, see what happens. There we go, we got the gym key. Okay, let's go. We're supposed to meet up with everyone in the main hallway. Okay, now we just gotta go meet everyone at the main hallway. Did you find the key? Sure did. You know, I heard a scream that sounded kind of familiar. Oh, he's such a dick. Huh? <laughs> Wait, you actually did? I was just kidding. You want to take this outside? Guys, come on. All right, we'll divide into teams again. Three of you will enter Tartarus, and one of you will remain outside with me. Once the dark hour begins, I'll pinpoint Yamagishi's position. I'm going in. You come too. You can take the lead as usual. I should said I'll be glad to help. Wait a second, Yukatan. Remember how I accidentally screwed up on the monorail? Give me a chance to make up for that. Oh, come on. It's not always about you. Besides, you didn't accidentally screw up. All right, Junpei, we'll give you another shot. And with that, the teams are set. Sweet. Thanks. What? What's wrong, Takeba? Do you have a problem staying with Mitsuru? Seems like it. Uh, no, no, it's fine. It's almost time. Let's go. Oh shit, we go straight to the midnight hour. Fuck. Hopefully, we can go to the. I. That's right. I. Guess I'm alone after all. Ruka. Uh-oh. Don't do it. No. No. I don't want to hear this. Crap. Holy me. I, oh. I have to go to school. Tell her I'm sorry. Oh, God. Oh, shit. She is a zombie! No. We still haven't heard back from them. The transmission range is at max, too. Moriyama is okay at the dorm. Unfortunately, no place is completely safe in the dark hour. But we couldn't risk bringing her here. And having one of us stay behind to watch her wasn't an option either. True. Yeah, I guess so. Well, we 
We are all here for Yamagishi-san's sake. So, can you me? I'm here. I've confirmed your position. You're higher up than I expected. You're barely in communication range. Is everyone all right? I don't know. Got stuff right. Akihiko. Come in, Akihiko. Is he out of range? That's worrying. Oh, crap. We got separated. I live! If I was Kipter, it's like, I'm okay. Must have lost consciousness. Up we go. Whoa! Are you awake? Not this guy again. This is the first time we've spoken outside of your room. Why are you here? I told you, remember? I'm always with you. But we don't have much time to talk tonight. There is more than one ordeal you must face. You should hurry. She's waiting for you. You guys will need her. See you. I hope we meet again. Hey, where are you? Ugh. That guy's really getting on my nerves. All right, it looks like we're on our own right now. Okay, so we're on our own. Now we gotta figure this out. Can I save? No, I cannot. I am in trouble here. Okay, looks like we're on our own for a bit. Nice. All right. It's over. I got the jack-o'-lantern. You serious? Uh, I don't know if I want to XP or money right now. I'm a little low on cash. Uh, screw it. I'm going to go for XP. Well, that's not a lot of XP. I should have went for the cash. Somebody's here. Is it Fuka? We'll start off with Jack Lantern in our monster here. Yes. Money. Definitely taking the money. XP's not even worth it. Are you human? No, I'm a ghost. Honestly, I might just not use SP because they don't really need. They're pretty weak. There's a way up. I don't even know what floor we're on, honestly. Ooh, another treasure chest. Nice, we got some wind element. Why am I here? Please, answer me. 
Hang on. I'm on my way, Fuka. Haha, <laughs> missed me, asshole. Was that supposed to do something? Gonna get rich. Let's check this way. Honestly, I'm doing this just so I can get rid of this guy. I just didn't want him anymore. He's not going to be much help. Nice, we got some revival beats. Definitely need those for later on. I kind of want to look go back real quick because I didn't know if there was any treasure chests or not. I might be also Fuka might be here in this floor too. Nope. Some more of that stuff there. Wonder if this is it. Nope. There they are. Glad you two are safe. I don't think we should enter Tartarus this way again. Oh yeah. Did you hear a voice on your way here? Yeah. Kinda like Who's there? Are you human? That's it! That's the voice! <laughs> Wait, didn't that come from behind us? There she is! Yes. Wow, you're alive. That's awesome. Never fear. The heroes are here. Idiot. Good to see you're okay. Come with us. Thank you so much. I... Yes, I'll be fine. Sorry, I'm just so relieved. Looks like I made the right call then. I'll see if I can contact Mitsuru. What is this place? One second I was at school, and then... Uh, it's kind of a long story. We can explain after we get out of here. Mitsuru, can you hear me? No good. All I hear is static. Oh, are you hurt anywhere? You've probably seen the monsters wandering around, right? So, there is something dangerous in here, then. I've gotten by without them finding me so far. Wait. You've avoided them this entire time? How is that possible? Um, 
It's hard to describe, but I can sort of tell where they are. Damn. What do you mean? Are you saying you're psychic or something? <sighs> she has the same power as Mitsuru, actually. She might be even stronger. Mitsuru's persona is always more combat focused to begin with. Persona? Persona! Hang on to this. Huh? Wait, is this is this a gun? I can't blame her on that. Think of it as a lucky charm. It doesn't actually fire bullets. Um okay. Alright, let's get out of here. Agreed. seen it so bright there's some research that indicates the shadows are affected by the phases of the moon although the same thing is true about humans that would explain Yucatan's mood swings hey, oh boy wasn't it a full moon the night we went to the monorail hmm? it was uh is something wrong hey did you see the moon on the night the dorm was attacked back in april Today is June 8th. The monorail incident happened on May 9th. The assault in the dorm was on April 9th. They were all on a full moon. Mitsuru, are you there? Shut those up. Hey, can you hear me? Mitsuru, come in! Mitsuru? Mitsuru! What is that? It's much bigger than the others. And it's attacking someone. Damn it! What the hell's going on? I'm totally lost here. It's one of them. My guess is right. They come every full moon. We've gotta hurry. The Arcana Shadows. Wait for me. Took down Priestess. What? I'm guessing this is. Guess that must be Emperor and Empress. Mitsuru, Takeba. <sighs> What's going on? Nothing's working. Madison, gotta draw the shadows away. Yeah, I'm on it. Hey, if it's a fight you want, then you've got it. Akihiko, be careful. Normal attacks don't work on them. Hey! What the? Oh, God. Uh, Uka. No, what are you doing here? Moriyama san? Hey! Come back! Shit. Please get out of here! It's not safe! I. I had to tell you. I'm sorry. Oh crap. Hey, look out. I have to protect her. Not good. Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha! Here we go. Persona unlocked. A persona? I can see. I I can see these monsters' weaknesses. Can it be? Just as I thought. Mitsuru, let her take her place. We'll handle these guys. 
All right, let's do this. I'll begin searching for the monster's weaknesses. Please give me some time. Unfortunately, though, we will have to stop here for now because I'm really short on time here. Thank you for watching these guys. We will pick up on this video and the boss fight here in the next video. If you like this video, hit that like button. And if you want to see more of this channel, hit that subscribe button and notification button. And I will post this video as soon as I can. Thanks for watching. You guys have a good day and night. And you stay safe out there. See you later.